Hi, I'm Caleb Dennison, and this is DT Daily. Coming up, Microsoft relaunches the Surface tablets, a 3D printer for 100 bucks, and your cat can now lock your new iPhone 5S. Microsoft's anticipated Surface 2 and Surface Pro 2 tablets launched yesterday, and Redmond is betting big on the upgrade after its first big tablet launch, the RT, got a pretty tepid reception from buyers. So what's new with the Surface 2 and Pro 2? Well, for one thing, the RT badging is nowhere to be seen on the outside. Under the hood, there's more horsepower, a USB 3.0 port, 1080p video output, and Microsoft is lining up a long list of accessories. Look for covers with a built-in extender battery, backlit keyboard, a special DJ cover, and a docking station with Ethernet and monitor outputs. The Surface 2 starts at $450, and it's a steep $900 for a Pro 2. Worth it? We're itching to test them and find out. Both models hit the street on October 22nd. One of the hottest tech trends of late is 3D printing, which allows creative types to forge just about anything from liquid resin and laser beams. Some guy is even printing out a car, piece by piece. It's cool stuff, but 3D printers aren't cheap. At least they aren't yet, but that may soon change. In a Kickstarter campaign, Renovated Design is showing a 3D printer developed from household items and a lot of smarts that they hope to eventually retail for only 100 bucks. The printer uses saline water, resin, mirrors, the headphone and microphone jack on a laptop computer, and frickin' laser beams to build objects while you wait. How much did they hope to raise? 50 grand. How much have they raised? Over a quarter million. Talk about printing money. Apple's iPhone 5S is a hit with millions sold in just the first three days of release. One key feature is the Touch ID fingerprint reader on the home button that's a key security measure. But it turns out it likes more than just fingerprints. There are reports coming from across the interwebs of people using various other body parts including toes, nipples and more, much more, along with animal parts like a cat's paw to lock and unlock their new phones. Hilarious? Absolutely. Practical? Oh, hey Fluffy, can you unlock my phone real quick? <laughs> kitty kitty. Yeah, I, uh, I think I'll stick with my fingerprint, thanks. And that's DT Daily for today. We'll see you tomorrow.